Hello you lovelies, welcome to the channel, it's Rad and after about a couple of years of break I am back with another set of videos and uh, these videos are going to be for uh, the week of 8th to 14th of April just let me make sure, yeah it is uh, from 8th to uh, 14th of April 2024 and they will refer to your star signs. Uh, this reading is going to refer to your star signs, so bear that in mind. And while you can use its information uh, to your own discretion, use it as a guidance, as advice. Uh, they may not 100% reflect to your personal situations. If you do wish me to read for your personal situations, you can always go to my website, a uh, link of which you will find in the description down below. There at the very front page, you will see full list of my services and as well their pricing. And based on your budget and as well your needs, you can go for uh, whichever one suits you best. So with that said and without further ado, let's jump straight away to the videos. Virgo Stern. And uh, I'm going to use two systems here. The Tarot, of course, is going to be the main course. But the first one, which I'm shuffling right now, is going to show us, guys, a situation, important one, that is, important situation or event that uh, the Tarot reading is going to refer to or is going to uh, revolve around, meaning the Tarot is going to show us how this situation and this thing is going to develop this event. And so the event, the event itself is these three cards, which speak. So we do have the clover, the uh, key, and the tower. And that refers to a multiple ways of... Uh, making business, but that is more like a side job, right? So we have a multiple opportunities for a side jobs for you uh, into the upcoming week, Virgo, to earn extra cash or to earn extra influence, something like this. <clears throat> and also another way how this situation can manifest, it is a... Uh, a small gains getting through to the government that is if you are trying to file for something or if you are uh, you know having say uh, a lawsuit coming in and, and whatnot so let's see what's going to come out of it with uh, the tarot cards let me shuffle here And uh, those are the three cards. Actually, that is nothing new that it is coming your way. These are the three cards, Ace of Cups, uh, the Fool card, and the Ten of Pentacles. So it, it's, it's unlikely to be the government thing, or at least I can't figure out how such a situation may arise. Because what the tarot shows, guys, it is that these side jobs, so to speak, are going to um, have a direct contribution to your independence, okay? That means that these side jobs are going to make you uh, relatively independent of your mortgage. So you're going to have, for example, no issue, start paying out your mortgage or no struggle paying out your mortgage. It's not going to be a big deal anymore and so on and so forth. That is just for an example, but this is like a... Uh, can I put it into words? Oh my God, it's so difficult to describe it. Uh, this is like a super unexpected good fortune because what tarot cards are showing here is that this will happen to be an impending change and it is nothing new under the sun that I said. Because according to Tarot, these are a first side activities, side jobs that you 
are already very accustomed to, right? And what I do suspect are that these are a side activities, side projects, all right, that you have tried to acquire, to make an acquisition of them, to be your thing to do in order to, again, take on this independence that they are carrying on with it, not just only independence, but as well more comfortable living. That is also something that it is within the cards. And uh, this week, April 8th to April 14th, an impending change happens in your environment, in your surrounding, that now allows you to be a part, to take on that job, right? To take on this project, to become a part of one of those side activities. Like for example, that could be also trying to get an extra shifts, being assigned for extra shifts, but up until this point, there was no opening. There is your opening because the one that had them fell ill or they have caught him stealing, you know, and it's fired from the job and now it is your turn, right? So that is how the impending change takes place. <clears throat> And again, I want to underline that that is an impending change within uh, uh, an activities you try to be a part of and you have been denied of, all right? So that isn't something new under the sun. And uh, by being part of these activities, by acquiring that project, by acquiring that side job, that will make your day-to-day -day experience what I like to say is something you are going to freaking love because that's going to be also an activity you will love as well, at least according uh, according to these cards. It's uh, very likely, guys, that that could be also offered by an old friend or some kind of an ex as well, but that is a long stretch, right? And it is within those cards. Ten of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups, where you end up on the wrong foot with someone, your ex-boss, your ex-colleague and whatnot. And, you know, they have gave that work to someone else, but now they are willing to give you a, a second chance. Well, it's not like a second chance, but to try a new, let's put it that way. So they're willing to try a new with you. And actually, this time around, things are going to work out. Now, what is super important here, all right, to take the job seriously, if you do decide so to take the job itself, because uh, the Ace of Cups and the Fool card, it kind of, when they are together as an elemental dignity, this isn't something you mess around with, this isn't something you fool around with, all right, this isn't something that's to be like whatever to you, especially if it is, you know, if it is a piece of cake, please don't be conspicuous about it. Okay, address it or at least put a face that it isn't important for you that things go forward with that side job, that things work. Even put a face that it is more important than your main job. And that's going to carry you for a long, long way. Now, if that's about the government thing and it's something with the government institution, you know, in small cases, that's going to be uh, <clears throat> the event for you. Uh, again, it's very important to convey that you are serious about th about that thing, that you really want to move forward with uh, the issue that concerns uh, the government. <clears throat> and by doing so, the government is going to give you a lot more leniency, at least according to these cards. And so that is uh, your reading, Volgo. Hopefully you do enjoy it and you do like it, guys. And if you do so, please consider subscribing for the channel. Uh, liking the video and hopefully we're going to see each other next time. Until then, bye.